So after a lot of thinking, I have actually decided that I will be reviewing Pile Up. Of course, um, Pile Up is one of the Demolition Derby contenders and is one of the new Thailand variants for 2021. As we can see, this is the 2021 packaging. And I will also be taking a closer look at the China release that was released previously, which is now really hard to get hold of. But yeah. So, how did I get this pile up? Well, I got this pile up from, of course, none other than Get Me Collectibles. I will leave his name here. From 2021 Singles Case C. Of course, if I do ever get a second one, I will open up the Thailand variant. Maybe do another video, just because that's the way how I roll. I do two vids in once. Of course, if I don't have a second one, pretty cool. But yeah, in that case, there was Jimbo as well. So, you might see a review on him in a little bit. But yeah. So, let's start off with the actual review. So, Pile Up, as we can see here, is his name. Made by Mattel, 3 Plus, with no paper stickers, of course. We can see Pile Up's artwork for the first time ever. Pretty cool. I like how his back is, like, not showing his back eyes. We've got Cars logo here on the back. He's from the 2021 Horizon Desert series. Mattel logo up there. Pretty cool. On the back, we can see some other Cars 3 diecasts. Of course, Pick Remember Fillmore, Danica Cruz, Kathy Copter, Taco, Jimbo, Pileup, and JD McPillar. You can see my reviews on Pick Remember Fillmore, Danica Cruz, JD, and Taco from 2021. I might be doing Kathy Copter and Jimbo next, so make sure you, you subscribe to see those videos. 2020, Made in Thailand. Pretty cool. So yeah. Now we're taking a closer look at Pile Up himself. I believe it is a her because if you look at the Thailand expression. I'm sorry about the darkness here guys. But the expression looks like she's a girl from Thailand. So that is quite strange. Yep. Yeah, we can see some smokestacks here on the side. Pretty cool. Nice expression. Dirt on the grill here at the front. Pretty cool. Lights on the hood. This red and green two-tone colour. Pretty cool. On the top we've got this 11. Which looks like it's been sprayed on. Spray on shoes. On the back we can see some eyes. Just a little bit creepy if you admit. Because... Most cars have two eyes or one eye, like Mike. But yep, this reminds me, this brings back memories from the lenticular line. When they had four eyes, but this car literally does have four eyes. Like, collectors would really be like, Oh, gotta get two cars, put one at the front and one at the back, showing it like this. That'd be kind of cool. That's what I, what I might do if I get another Thailand release. Another Thailand one. On the side, she's got red rims with this green trim. Bit like a moon shape. Don't know why I said she. Eleven here on the side as well. Pretty cool in this orange colour. And you can see the back portion of the car going up. And here is the base made in China. Pretty cool. You can see some variants. Yep, that does end today's review on Pile Up. Of course, I try to make my videos not too long, and again, they're not made for kids. Been actually really pretty, pretty happy with YouTube recently for not, you know, putting kids on my channels and turning off the comments. We do have some other cars. We've got Belize from 2021, we've got Blind Spot, Jambalaya Chimichanga from Case A. Also from Case C, we've got Taco. With the Thailand variant, as you can see, the Thailand eyes. But yeah, if you're new, make sure you hit that red subscribe button. Turn it white. Of course, for you subscribers out there, thank you ever so much for the support recently. You don't know how much it means to me, obviously. But yeah, of course, always make sure you leave a like as well when you watch my videos. Of course, dislike for that one person that still does. For some weird reason. Also, hit the bell notification button down below. Till next one. Bye, guys.